don't want to go. Mm. Bye. He's upset, he doesn't want me to go. Good morning, everybody. So I am coming to you this morning from Pisa in Italy, which is very, very exciting. I've never been to Italy before. This is my first time. So we arrived in Pisa late last night and we are here to shoot my next Pretty Little Thing edit, which is so exciting. Everybody thinks I've just released an edit. Um, I did like a really cool shoot with PLT not that long ago. With loads of like tie-dye outfits and like really cool dresses and stuff. Um, and everyone's like, congrats on your new edit. But <laughs> nobody realizes that I'm actually shooting my, ed my actual edit now. Um, so yeah, we're in Italy shooting PLT. I'm gonna vlog the whole weekend. We're only here for two days so today tomorrow and then we leave on monday um but it's a bit sad because i really want to see more of italy but i guess we're going to kind of see it from where we're shooting we're shooting like up a mountain in a quarry um so i'll have to show you the location like where we are and stuff it's very exciting so call time today is actually really late like i'm so shocked when i read the um schedule it's actually nine o'clock right now and i'm just about to go into glam tomorrow though <laughs> tomorrow is the big boy call time is 5 a.m 5am guys you know I don't do mornings so that's gonna be an interesting one um considering that we're actually an hour ahead as well so realistically like in UK time it's actually 4am but we're not gonna dwell on that we're not gonna think about it it's fine I had the fitting for this edit not that long ago and I'm over the moon with every single piece like I cannot wait for you guys to see this and shop this I think you're gonna absolutely love it enough rambling I'm gonna head down now um in my pretty little thing dressing gown didn't have the best night's sleep last night I couldn't work out how to turn the aircon on um so I was sleeping sleeping in literally like an oven I was like oh, my back was literally like Niagara Falls it was so wet and, like sweaty it was disgusting I'll just show you what's outside my bedroom window it's like Piccadilly Circus out here like it's so busy this is my view this morning I don't know what that is over there I think it's um a train station actually Actually, I think it's the um, Pisa train station, uh, which is kind of cool. Like, it's a really nice view. Got a lot going on. Okay, so we are back at my room now. I'm just grabbing a few bits and then we're gonna leave for the location. We're gonna get in the cars now and travel. Um, I've not had any breakfast or anything. I never really know what to have on the morning of a shoot because whenever I eat, I get so bloated like instantly. So I'm probably just gonna have some fruit on the way. Um, but yeah, I've just packed a little bag of everything that I need. I don't really take much of me. Um, on a shoot but I don't really want to like leave certain stuff in the room so I've just packed a little bag um Ellie Belly might be in there I don't like leaving Ellie Belly in hotel rooms recently like we are now gonna go in these jeeps to go up to where we need to go to like the quarry um i think it, i don't know how long, far it's gonna be but it took us about an hour to get here so now the last little bit of the journey is gonna be in these jeeps hopefully we won't fall off the mountain but there's no toilet up where we're shooting so um, we all need to go to the toilet now and try and squeeze every last bit of wee out of my bladder right guys so i'm gonna go outside in a second and show you the location and where we are it's literally insane but the rail is up and my edit is here time to shoot it so this is all the jewelry that we're gonna pair it with and this is the first look so it's like a towel set with a little bikini top bikini bottoms and these are really cute toweling shorts i'm so into this material right now it's so in um i love it so that's gonna be the first look we're shooting just so then i can eat a baguette crisps and live my best life on this shoot and not have to worry about being bloated um but yeah we've got some really really amazing looks this is a really attractive look. I've got tissue all around my head. Um, but yeah, it's so bright out there because where we are, it's like all marble um, and marble reflects. So like literally the sun is bouncing from every single angle. Um, so I think we're gonna use a lot of sunglasses for this shoot. So this is the secret location that we are shooting at today. It is a marble quarry. It is absolutely unbelievable. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Yeah, as I said before, it's super, super bright. Um, I think a lot of the looks are gonna be with sunglasses because of how sunny it is. <laughs> look at me, anyway, this is the first look. So this is the little baby blue towel set. I am honestly obsessed with it. It's like a bikini top, bikini bottoms, and then the blue towel shorts. And then I'm wearing with these blue, uh, baby blue thong heels, which I'm obsessed with as well. So first look, obviously these tissues will be coming out. Um, can't wait to get started.
number one is yeah. done. Just seen some of the shots and I am so, so, so pleased with them. It is worth all the sweat and all the dust that we're all getting on ourselves from this marble rock um but yeah we're moving on to the second outfit now which is going to be a dress i think so i'll show you when i have it on get my hair sorted and then we're changing locations um but as soon as my hair is done i will show you what we do we're going to do a high snatched ponytail um which i'm really excited to do so i'll show you what it looks like when we're done i'm wearing this next outfit which is this lime green tight tie-dye dress i absolutely love this outfit it's so extra so we've just done a hair change this is what we've got a long sleek ponytail i feel like i always love these on prt shoots just because you can like really work with it and, like swish it around just do crazy stuff with it being a model is hard guys i don't know how people do it full time you know like i i could never do it full time um yeah, doing it once every so often is it's challenging, but these shoots that we do like a intense, like tomorrow we're shooting an advert as well, which I'm really excited to show you guys, like the behind the scenes of shooting an advert, um, which I think will be really interesting. But yeah, these shoots are always the best. They're just so um, like intense because like obviously I want everything to look perfect. I want every look to be perfect and flawless and every single picture has to be perfect. Every single video. For each outfit, there's like five things that need to be pictured and filmed. Um, so it's like a lot of work, but it's so worth it when you get the end product. I'm so excited to see all the shots and the advert in a couple of weeks time. and we were that hungry we came straight to mcdonald's and i forgot to literally show you um how much food we ordered we've come all the way to italy for a shoot and we're sat in mcdonald's currently but there's just nothing that could beat in mcdonald's at the end of a long day when you've been on your feet all day um we just fancied a quick bit of food so i mean when i say a bit i mean a lot um this is what we got i got a chicken burger chips everywhere yeah. Yeah. none of the guys want to get in it so i'm just gonna film this hello Yay! Um, so yeah, we're just gonna indulge. The shoot went really, really well, but I will update you on everything when I get back to the hotel. Right now, I just need to eat. So, it's 5.30 in the morning. I just don't function at this time. I don't function at this time. Never have, never will, never plan to. This is the middle of the night. The middle of the night. Um, so yeah, I'm really annoyed at myself because I knew I needed to close the vlog off last night. Didn't do it. Didn't do it. I closed off about three other vlogs, but I closed off another vlog um, that I edited last night. Um, and when I closed off, I was just talking about how unimpressed I am with this camera. Like, if you've been able to hear, like, crackling or I've been unfocused during this vlog... I can only but apologise. I'm absolutely switching back to my old camera. It sounds like it's this in the background all the time. Anyway, went to sleep at half one. More to, more like two, actually. Um, I don't know why I do it to myself. Like, the reason we didn't go out for dinner last night and we went for McDonald's was so that I had an early night. Didn't go to sleep until nearly two o'clock in the morning because I was up editing videos. But I just find I'm most productive, like, late at night. <laughs> um, we're shooting the advert today. And 11 more outfits. 11 outfits doesn't sound like a lot to shoot in one day but when you've got a shoot campaign pictures econ pictures mannequin pictures and film a tv advert for each advert um for each item i need to go back to bed for each outfit it's a lot it's a lot i'm not gonna lie but we just get through. Wish me luck for today, poor myself as always, but I know it's gonna be fine. And the feeling when you finish like day two or like whenever the last day is and you get into bed and you're like, oh, I smashed it. That's the best feeling in the world. So I can't wait for that tonight. Uh, yeah. So we're back in the little spot where we're gonna get taken up to the mountain today. It is so cool and so such nice weather right now. I wish, wish, wish it would stay like this all day, but it's definitely not going to. It's definitely gonna get extremely hot. Um, 
You're not really coming my vlogs much. No, I know. She did so well yesterday. <laughs> oh, I look thanks. awful. We've just woke you up, don't. guys. Yeah. <laughs> I was getting Molly ready all morning. That thing when she's in oh. bed and she pretends. Oh my Have you goodness. Seen it when you're that... feeling sick to the manager. <laughs> oh, really? What a meme. <laughs> and it's like. I need. Ouch. So everything's sharp, yeah. isn't it? She's in. <laughs> We're in the. Is it a defender? Uh, yeah, land rover. We'll be calm, not the, the mountain when, when we come. come. We'll be calm, not the mountain when we come. I just heard the song for the out for the advert, and it's a really good one. I'm really happy with it. Um, so we're gonna like play it whilst I'm um filming, so that I can get like the vibe and everything. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. Oh okay, guys, outfit number one is on. Still got my tissue in my hair. Don't mind that. Uh, I have this outfit on. It's really, really cool. It's like this red bikini top um, with jeans, and I have like a little cropped red denim jacket. It's like a kind of like a three-piece cord. Um, I'm absolutely obsessed with it. We're shooting in a different location today, so the backdrop is a little bit different. It's still kind of like marble quarry vibes, but like a little bit different. Um, so yeah, we're gonna head over there now. So, blue blazer is now shot, and we're gonna just quickly change my lip because I keep eating and getting crumbs all over it. Mmm. Mmm. Yummy. But we are whizzing free. We've done like four looks now. Three or four actually, but we've not been shooting for very long, so that's good. <laughs> we're um, doing really well. The clouds have just gone over though, so it's not that sunny anymore. So we're going to wait till the sun comes out. The shoot has now been gate crashed by quad bikers. Um, this is the sort of thing that Tommy would do. He loves quad biking. Wouldn't be surprised if he's on this blooming trip. Look at this. We've been hijacked. Well, yeah, I don't know how they're doing that because literally the road is this thin. How is that even legal? So next look is a bandana look with this tie-dye dress. Never really normally wear bandanas. I did on my Instagram the other day actually for the first time and I really liked it. Belly belly. So we've now done a hair change and a makeup freshen up. Um, we've gone from this like slick back, long, 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 long braid, um, which is so sick. So I'm so excited to like swish this around and use it as a bit of like a prop. So we're gonna head down to the location that we were at yesterday just because um, it's got like a lot more open space in here. There's quite a few like construction vehicles and stuff. So there's not a lot of open space for video because the video obviously you've got to like move around a lot. Um, and we keep like getting like little bits of like this huge yellow tractor in here, which is obviously not right, ideal. How many are there? Like, seven, six? Six, seven out, six left. Six, that's good. Six is fine. That's guys that is a wrap so we have now finished every single outfit for my new plt x molly may edit and it's such a good feeling this has been like the maddest two days ever it's been really hard work but so, so rewarding i'm so 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 happy we've actually finished a little bit before schedule as well which has never ever 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 happened before <laughs> so yeah, that is a wrap. Finishing in leather in 32 degree temperatures, but would that be in the way of the dawn? I know. Hey <laughs> guys, we are celebrating the end of the shoot with a celebratory cornetto. <gasps> I literally thought that you were telling the truth. Anyway, um, we're celebrating with a cornetto. I'm so happy right now. We're in the car. I've got my pillow. I could cry of happiness. Um, it's gone so well today, and I'm so happy. And we're gonna head back to the hotel now to go out for some really nice dinner. But I've got so much work to do when I go out to the hotel. The grind, the grind never stops. I'm trying to vlog. What are you doing? <laughs> About what? So 
bit of a like, crazy move right now. Myself and Jay are going to cut my hair. Now, this is only because um, I've had these bonds in for a really long time now, and on Thursday, I am getting my hair redone, and I'm getting brand new hair from Beauty Works um, put into my head, so this hair will be going. I might as well just cut it all off, go back to the bob for literally one night. Um, on, sit still, <laughs> don't move. She's like the worst client to have. No, I'm not. I'm actually a really good client. I don't I'm move. Joking. She's my favorite, most favorite client. Right. Let's so we're going from 22 inch to about 10 inches. <laughs> so literally one inch. But I'm not going to forget to vlog. Uh, we're now out for dinner. Um, my food has just come. I got a spag bowl. Um, I got a spag bowl the first night we got here. And I didn't really like it. But this one looks way nicer. And I'm definitely going to like this one. I can tell. I really, really would keep my hair this length. But um, obviously, like, I'm a beauty works ambassador. We are now finally back at the room. Um, I've been really rubbish with vlogging this evening. But basically all that happened was I cut my hair, or Jay cut my hair, and then we went for some dinner at this like really nice Italian restaurant. We had like a spag bowl. And I'm ready to also get home and like get into a bit of a routine um, before I also fly to, well, I'm not sure where I'm going next, it's Switzerland or Paris. I have another shoot coming up really soon. Um, so I need to try and get back into a bit of a routine before I go away again. I think this edit might actually be my favourite. I know that's a big statement and I think I've said that about every single like collection and edit that I've bought out with PLT. But this one is like so different and it's like got loads of colour in it. Um, it's like a very like just fun edit and it's very different to anything I've done so far with PLT. Everything's been very nude, blacks, whites, cream, beiges. This has like got a lot of colour in it which I'm really really excited about. I'm going to be styling the pieces up on my Instagram so make sure you head over there and follow me if you don't already. Let me know in the comments so what you think about the short hair if you prefer it long or if you prefer it slightly shorter because I just put an Instagram picture up and all the comments are saying that they think I should keep this hair because basically I'm meant to be getting my long hair back literally in a couple of days um, but everyone's saying they prefer it short so before I forget I just wanted to quickly mention that I am going to be reaching a million subscribers soon which is so exciting um, and I'm actually going to be getting a few things for my giveaway that I'm going to be doing um, when I get home so make sure you keep your eyes peeled for that and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already um, and like this video if you enjoyed it so yeah anyway I'm going to go now because I've been rambling for ages um, thank you so much for watching this video I really really hope you enjoyed it and hopefully I'll see you all in my next one night guys